and give all praises again in Hebrew to the Heavenly Father, which is to say, Kal Halal, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bashem Raka Kodash. So, okay. Double and the apostles of Great Mill Stone, the apostles and elders of Great Mill Stone, Shalom to the Akim. Pushing this word in sincerity and true to the sisters, the believers, and those that help push the ministry. Shalom to you as well. Um, also, I want to say Shalom wa Ahab wa Barakim laha bakhayar yasharala, which is to say um, peace and love and blessings to the elect of Israel. Now, um, right, so here we have a video on the screen, you know, I mean, of you know, some Jews. Coming back to the motherland, right? Um, yeah, some Ukrainian Jews coming back to the motherland. Let's make the video play, then we can get in some scriptures. In the early morning, 130 Ukrainian Jews landed in Tel Aviv to begin a new life. Right, so. Wait, I know as a matter of fact, let's just make the whole video. You see the moment when these new immigrants step on. Of people who have been exiled for so long, who then return to their homeland, return to their language. And so there's the prophetic reality of this that's so huge that each one of these people, Isaiah saw, Jeremiah saw, they saw them, they saw this happening, and now we are here to witness it. We are here to be part of it. Their flight marked the one year passing of Yael Eckstein's father, Rabbi Yakiel Eckstein the founder of the International Fellowship of Christians and Jews. Now right, so there you have it. A whole bunch of crap coming out of this ass right here. You know what I mean? Um, there's no way in this, nowhere in the scriptures saying that 130 Israelites will be returning to Israel. That's nowhere to be found in the scriptures. I see. 130 Ukrainian crackers, Amalekites are returned to the land saying that these are the Jews or these are Israelites. No. You know what I mean? That's wrong, yo. You know what I mean? Right? These are 130 thieves. More thieves in our land, yo. You know what I mean? And when the time of our deliverance come, the true deliverance of the children of Israel come, Right, you thieves will be answering to us, to our to our power first and foremost, and our Lord our shy, and then you are going to answer to we, you know what I mean? We are going to build back the country, we want to tear down, we want to destroy, you know what I mean? Um, this is Isaiah 11 and 11, it says, and it came to and it shall come to pass in that day that Yahweh, that the Lord shall set his hand again the second time to recover the remnant of his people, which shall be left from Assyria and from Egypt and Pathros and from Cush and from Elam and from Shinar and from Hamath and from the islands of the sea. Right? Isaiah wasn't talking no, um you know what I mean? Being delivered back to the land. You know what I mean? First and foremost, first and foremost, yo, um, um, hey, we're not going to get delivered in another damn plane, yo. You know what I mean? No, whatever they want to call it. We're not going to get delivered in another plane. This is how we're going to be delivered, yo. Right? First and foremost, the Lord will come defend we, and then we're going to be delivered. Right, what the so called white man call UFOs, the chariots of heaven, right, as birds flying, so will Yahweh of, of the armies defend Jerusalem. Defending also, he will deliver it and passing over, he will preserve it, right. And in our talk about literal Jerusalem over there, so you know, what I mean, Jerusalem is the people, yo, right, Jerusalem is us. We are the city of peace, not the so-called white man, not you Edomites, right? The sons of perdition, the sons of the son of perdition, you know what I mean? Right? So, so like, yeah. 
right? So we are gonna be defended, yo. Right? We gonna be defending. Why are we gonna be defended? Because we're in our streets. Right? You you see them Edomites, you see them Edomites, Elamites, Assyrians, um all I wanna Eden nations, yo, right? After we, right? We know a child to be hurt. That's why the Heavenly Father come to defend we. Then we're gonna be delivered, yo. And start. Start disintegrate people left, right, and center. Even some of our people are gonna get, feel that two thirds are gonna get it. You know what I mean? Because they're wicked as hell. You know what I mean? But ultimately, the Lord are come to deliver we, yo. See, the Lord is coming to deliver the, the 144,000 elect. You know what I mean? Not 130. Right? And this is, as a matter of fact, before I read that, before I read the sweet script, this is, where is it? Um, my car, seven. Right? There we go. Right, this is Micah 7, right, and verse 7, right, it says, Therefore I will look unto Yahweh, I will wait for my God, Salaki, I will wait for the God of my salvation, um, we we'll call it commercial ear, ear plane, seen, we're we'll gonna get delivered by the hands of the Heavenly Father, yo, in a chariots, right, and while we we'll get delivered, guess what, the earth will be burning, right, Revelation 15. And um and one the sea of glass yo. Seen. That's how, how that is how deliverance are gonna go. Not one hundred and thirty crackers um uh, uh, um uh, migrate peacefully. Peacefully yo. You know what I mean? Make sure they never have in a no farmer streets. Seen. With them, with them, with them made up persecution, both Holocaust. Holocaust, yes. You know what I mean? Right? Come with them made up persecution, yo. Right? When them are the real persecutors, they be persecuted, yo. Yeah, mono mama. Okay. Alright, so here we have Revelation 7 and verse 4. Right? Alright, so this is Revelation 7. I'm going to read from verse 3. Um, basically, um, before that, you know, um, the Heavenly Father, uh, the four angels holding the four winds of the earth, right? Verse 3 saying, Hurt not the earth, neither the sea nor the trees, till we have sealed the servants of our power in their foreheads. Verse 4, And I heard the number of them which were sealed. And there were sealed an hundred and forty and four thousand of all, all the tribes of the children of Israel. Again, an hundred and forty and four thousand of all the tribes of the children of Israel. Not one hundred and thirty. So, you know what I mean? These crackers claim to be Jews, right? But what happened to the ten tribes? Right? The ten tribes aren't lost. Them like to say the ten lost tribes. The ten tribes aren't lost, yo. The ten tribes are known. Them lost to themselves because a majority of them don't know who them, are, who them be. See? But we know them. You know what I mean? And who for know, know themselves, yo. Right? Um, it says, of the tribe of Judah. Not going to read it. It says, of the tribe of Judah are... Go down some more now. This right, um, what were they? the tribe of Issachar, the tribe of Zebulun, right, the tribe of Joseph, and the tribe of Benjamin. See, were sealed 12,000. So, uh, 12,000 get sealed from all tribes, you know what I mean, and all of them gonna be delivered. Thus, say the Lord, how about Shem Shai. Right, um, let's go verse 9 now. Can I just read it from here? So, nations 
and kindreds and people and tongues. Right, so you're going to have, you're, you're literally going to have Israelites being delivered.